Hello and welcome to Hank Green Plays Assassin's Creed Revelations. I've been exploring this cistern, trying to find a key, uh, one of the five keys to Altair's something or other. And, uh... Every long story short, it's been a bit of a... debacle. Um, I was supposed to not ever be, uh, detected, ever. Um, I have done pretty much the exact opposite of that. I started out attempting to continue uh, to not be to not be detected, but boy, that did not last long. Um, so I need some more smoke screens. This that's the that's the smoke screen. What have I been using? Smoke decoy. The smoke screen would be much better. Okay. So let's get the smoke screen. Splinter bomb smoke screen. Excellent. Okay. That's what I wanted from the beginning, man. There's only like one guy in here. Smoke screen is awesome. Officially awesome. Yeah, I I did like a smoke decoy, and that was totally not useful. But then I did a smoke screen, and it was freaking sweet. So I have to get up there, everybody. That's that's what I gotta do. Which should not be a problem because I'm freaking Ezio Auditore, and I know how to get places. I did not even have to kill that guy. I did it for fun. I kind of feel bad about that now. Never like to kill people unless I have to. There is someone down here. With us. Yes, that's true. Every all of your friends are your dead. Eyes open and your hands steady. Also, if you could stay like all standing in the same place, that would be fantastic. Use eagle sense to identify the Templar. Freaking! I not a speed reader. Okay. What do I have to do to him? Kill the Templar Captain to get the next gate key. No problem, yo. Um, so let's do the decoy. Smoke decoy. That was actually the smoke screen. And that was not what I wanted at all. So... <laughs> Let's do a splinter bomb right in that same area. No one, no one's going to see what's going on in there. So, there they go. Nope, too, not good. Ha <laughs> <laughs> I suck at game. Smoke decoy. You guys want to go see what that was? You interested in that? Ah, uh, jeez! Oh, come on! <laughs> so now I need the smoke screen. Is that the right guy? Don't even know. He is getting away. But I just said that I don't like to kill people if I don't have to. So I'm not going to kill whoop, you if I don't have to. But I can't uh, apparently move on unless you guys are dead. Where did they cut clothes like that? He's fine. Get him now. 
Yep, got it. You're all in trouble now. Oh. Yep, you're all in trouble now. Ah! You okay, Ezio? Oh, I've got the big stick, man. I got the big stick. And I know I'm underneath a bridge, so it's hard to see what's going on, but let me tell you, whatever it is is great. Whatever it is is very exciting, and I'm just gonna keep pushing the button until everybody's dead. Which is what I did. Everybody's dead now. No, that's okay, Ezio. You don't have to do that. So, that, I'm learning? Let's just say I'm learning. It's a bit of a learning curve. Uh, the bombs. Hidden secrets, eh? What is that? Is that a hidden secret? Are there hidden other? What is this? Hi, Lemon. You're the cutest. I know. You are. Is that a hidden secret? No, it's not. Got a tripwire. Also not a hidden secret. But at least our chests. Chests are my favorite. Target located, everybody. I found it. Open the hidden door. Okay. With B. Oh, I have senses like an eagle, I'm telling you. Moving right along. What did you find? 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 What's that? Am I gonna have to fight? Retrieve the Masyaf key. Am I gonna have to fight? That's a key? That doesn't look like a key. It looks like a, like a CD-ROM. Remove the Masyaf CD-ROM. It's, uh, it's Green Day's Dookie. Uh, do not be detected. Yeah, that was super failed. Where do I go now? Where do we go now? Where do we go? <gasps> infinite grid! We go to the infinite grid! That's where we always go when the mission is ended. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. That was totally freestyle. Uh, combo. I know how to combo kill. It's always giving me instructions on how to do things that I already know how to do. There's actually, it seems to be a pattern. Like, there's a, oh, there's a sparkly thing in that direction. Let's go get it! Get the sparkly thing. Hello, how's it going? I'm covered in blood and sewage. That took some time. What did you find? Blood and sewage. Interest you. What? And here is my shop. What? What? When did we find? When did we find that? Strange symbols, and these are titles of books. Rare books. A few of these have not been seen for more than a millennium. My goodness. Blue Polo hid these books around the city. Ooh. This map should tell us where. That's exciting stuff. Hmm. You're beginning to interest me. Vaguely. Vaguely? Yeah. I am sort of an old what dude, but tell, let me tell you. I need to find these three books first. They may contain clues to locate the rest of these. It's a CD-ROM. It's from the future. Another was found beneath Topkapa Palace. But there is still time to reach the others. Found by whom? Men who do not read. Sophia, can you decipher this map? Help me find these books. Can I borrow them when you are finished? We will work something out. <laughs> borrow? I bet we will work something out. They always do seem to work things out with the ladies, Ezio. Well... This is definitely a short episode, um, so I should probably do something else, like look around. I'm outside. I'm outside. <laughs> I kind of. That doesn't seem like a horrible place to live. You can't smell it, though. I bet it didn't smell super good. That's why they had incense burning all the time, like that thing there and this over here. 
generally I feel like old old building old cities never smell particularly good like King's Landing and uh, and the, the Song of Ice and Fire they're always talking about how horrible it smells and uh, Ankh-Mor pork in uh, the disc world it's a very ripe little place um, disc world by the way uh, best series Yusuf. ever Salute. and uh, Piri told me the newest one is quite good and you if you've you not read it? Terry Pratchett, go I do it. I so. And I envy you to have so much this Terry Pratchett ahead of you in your life. Five keys. What? A strange artifact. Yeah. It's ah, like a hard drive platter. It is like nothing I have ever seen. You should keep it somewhere safe. At our headquarters. See, I will. That doesn't seem that safe to me. What brings you this way? Or maybe. I am coordinating with our allies today. The thieves in the bazaar. The mercenaries near the arsenal, and the Romanis in the Constantine district. You are spread a bit thin, Yusuf. Let me speak with the Romanis myself. I have had so little contact with them in the past. I don't know what they are, so. That would ease my mind. If you are in a hurry, you may travel by our network of tunnels. The air down there is a little foul, but huh? the rats are no bigger than dogs. Have fun. Grazie. Grazie. Well. Now, that seems like an adequate amount of time for an episode of Hank Puzz Assassin's Creed Revelations. You will ask me and I'll not see you next time, but you will hear me as I fast travel through this tunnel and uh, head to uh, talk to the Romanes. The Romanes, which I don't know anything about. Uh, no idea. Where am I going? There, apparently. I'm going to Arcadius. Arcadius! And goodbye.